What is up, you guys? It's your homeboy, Josh. For today, I'm going to be reviewing ID Mobile, which is um, a telecommunications provider in the UK. So basically, um, to begin with, there's no doubting ID Mobile's main pull is their low prices. So basically, they are very famous for offering budget, um, budget conscious mobile plans on their phone contracts and sim only deals but they do have things like 5g and wi-fi calling going for them through the coverage through three can be a liability so it's actually disappoint uh quite disappointing to see ied mobile removing uh their telephone based customer service it was one of the things actually that they had over the, over other low cost rivals like smarty and it's knocked their record with ofcom so there are some nice little added benefits with them, like data rollover, their flexible spending caps, and we've been a long, we've been a fan of their app for a long time actually. So, um, basically when uh I tried using ID Mobile, the one of the things that I really liked was uh first the prices were really um really cheap and. Also, the speed wasn't really bad, you know, like it was it was at par with uh, its competitors out there. So actually, their mobile app lets you manage your account better than other providers, as I would say. So um, if you want to if you want to join or if you want to go for ID mobile, I would I want to give you the pros and cons, actually. So the, the pros of um, ID mobile is the data roll over scheme. 5G, 4G calling and Wi-Fi calling, and the uh, they have a really brilliant app to manage your account. And then when it comes to the cons, the cons are scrapped tel telephone customer service. Actually, this is one of the things that's very important because, um, you know, customers is uh, the biggest factor why a business lives. And customer satisfaction is also one of the biggest factors wherein you can you know you could step up as a company so when they removed actually the telephone customer service it actually had a really big impact because um everybody nowadays uses their phone it's like um having a mobile phone nowadays is an is a necessi necessity already it's not a luxury so you really want to have um you really want to have the customer support that you need 24/7 and you want it accessible. So you, when they stripped off the, tele, the telephone customer service, uh, it really had, um, it took a bite out of them. So the next con is less 4G away from big, big towns and cities. Last is limited extra perks. So in this review that I made, I actually went to check their mobile network coverage. So... Actually, it has really impressed me because ID Mobile uses three's network. So they basically they piggyback on their network for calls, 3G and data, 3G, 4G, 5G signals, which has its upsides and downsides. I guess um, all companies has that. So there is actually a coverage map that they have provided and you can check it out online. So their hosts have made huge investments into expanding 4G into rural areas and it really shows. So they're beginning to catch up to networks on Vodafone and EE when it comes to rural 4G coverage. ID Mobile are still behind other networks though for call signal, which is 3G. That means you are more likely to find total signal black spots both outdoors and also indoors as their call signal isn't that good as getting into buildings. So they're uh, a little bit behind other networks for rural mobile signal even with their 4G signal expansion, but for the most part, ID Mobile offers a good overall signal mix in the areas where people live. So, um, moving moving on to extra network features. So basically, they are a bit low on extra network features. Let me tell you more about it. So basically, they let you use your phone as a personal Wi-Fi hotspot, allowing you to connect non-data devices to your data signal. So you can actually use your entire allowance for this if you want, as long as you're in the UK. You also get call forwarding included on every ID mobile plan. This lets you divert incoming calls to another number 
if you want to keep one line free from calls. So uh, it's worth noting also the ID Mobile doesn't offer any free Wi Fi hotspots. All right. So I guess um, those are the, uh, the very vital details that you need to know if you're going to go for ID Mobile. So for the budget conscious out there, this network is for you. And however, if you if you're still on the face of deciding if you're going to choose ID Mobile, you simply just have to align the the services that are offered by ID Mobile to your personal needs, your personal preferences, and your um your plans or or the way that you're using your phone, so that you could make a very good decision in choosing what mobile network you should go for. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. For a lot of more videos like this, this is your homeboy Josh and I'm going to see you on the next video.